Hey guys and welcome back to Grip Geeks where today we have a grip test of the Jordan Why Not 0.1. That's right, a shoe that's done pretty well in some of our battles. Today is the day it gets put to the true test and it gets measured for eternity. On our wood surface, finished like an NBA court, we put it on our guy, we're gonna test it forward, we're gonna test it sideways, see how it compares to all the other shoes on our wall. Time for some hardcore traction action. All right, so this shoe, the Jordan Why Not, we have seen this shoe take down some big names. This is what we think one of our top shoes, so we are going to put this in our 80 pound weight class to start to see if it can handle that weight because this shoe, I think is gonna be really good. Yeah, the shoe's got a nice flat bottom uh, that goes all the way from the back of the shoe to the front with very little contouring. So this shoe really kind of gets on the ground and gives you a lot of traction both directions. It'll be interesting to see how it does with its forward grip compared to its side grip. Uh, if you guys wanna know more about how we test, we've got a separate video for that. We'll put the link uh, towards the end of this video down below. Check out the uh, how we measure and all that, but you're gonna see it in play here. So you ready to test? I'm ready. All right, let's, let's do it. see it. All right, so here we go. We're actually gonna do 90 pounds in the basket because we think this shoe is that good to be in this top weight class. We're gonna see only one shoe that we've tested so far is in the 90 pound weight class. Uh, we're gonna try and see if this one can hang in. If it can't, we'll drop it down the class. Man, All right, here, here we, go. we go. 140 pounds in play. Man. When it crosses the start electronic line, the timer will start. Tell me when you're gonna let go. Yeah, ready? Here we and go. I'm guarding. Go. Oh, and, and clearly, clearly not in the 90 pound weight class. Wow. The Jordan Why Not cannot take 90 pounds. 70 pound weight attempt. Ready? And I expect this to be here. Here we go. Not touching it. No, let it go. Let it go. Yeah, yeah, I'm not touching it. See, I think it's not in this weight class. It's too no, good for this it weight. It's too good. The Jordan Why Not seemingly here we go. Is, too good. is going. So this might it be going. This you know might what? take it. Let's see. This is moving faster than I expected. I expected I this shoe to be I think better it than it is right off. now. I think it wobbled off at 80 pounds. I don't think it can handle 80. Don't think it can handle 80. Mm -hmm. I actually agree with that. This 70 is, pounds seems like right. the true test for the Jordan Why Not. I agree. This is going to be a good valid test right here. Yeah, it is not going to be one of the top two shoes. No, no. And, and there top is. two stand alone. 29.17 the final score for the Jordan Why Not at 70 pounds. All right, so you just saw the forward test at 29.17 in the 70 pound weight class, the Jordan Why Not. It is time for the side test. Let's do it. All right, here we go with the side test. All right, 70 pound weight class, 70 test. pound weight class. Here we go, ready? Gonna take it, not touching it. I'm not, I'm not even letting go yet. Wow, it, ready? I don't know if it's is, gonna handle it. I don't know, I'm gonna guard. Oh, wow. There we go, there we go. There, there we, we go. go, found it. The timer is Found started. it just in time. It did. Can it make it to eight seconds of stay in the weight class? It can, this is the weight class. It is the weight class. This is the weight for the Jordan Why Not. Let's see what it finishes at. Already at 15 seconds, not a bad score. And 17, 0.69 is the final score at 70 pounds on the side test. All right, so you just saw the forward and the side. The forward test was at the 70 pound weight class and the side test you saw also in the 70 pound weight class. So a great showing today for the Jordan Why Not. That's right, but a lot of great shoes that we are testing behind this so I don't know that it's gonna hold on to its position as we go down. Uh, we're gonna catch up all these new shoes that have just come out and then get our table up to date. Check out the rank table. Go sign up on our site at gripgeeks.com. Every time we add a shoe, we'll send you an alert. You can see how it changes the ranking of this shoe compared to all the other shoes. As we go forward, we'll see how these shoes measure up to find out which shoe has the best shoe of any shoe out there. That's where you find it, only at
Don't forget to subscribe, like us on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Make sure to share us with your friends and stay tuned for future videos because we have more tests coming. That's right, if you want to see more tests, hit that like button and subscribe. Leave us a comment, let us know what new shoes you want us to get and add to our test and put on our table. We'll try and get our hands on a pair for you. Until then, we'll see you on the court.